Xiao Yao asked Tu Shan Jing, what if her real face is ugly? Tu Shan Jing said, that's good. Xiao Yao was puzzled, how could she be okay if she was ugly? Tu Shan Jing said, the beauty of behavior can be seen by everyone, the beauty of the heart cannot be seen by the eyes, and I am willing to enjoy it alone. This sentence is too level and too deeply rooted in the hearts of the people, which girl can resist it? The key is that these words are from Jing's heart, not just words or just to make Xiao Yao happy. But he really sees through that the appearance is not as important as the heart, and the most precious thing in a person is kindness, not appearance. Of course, this has something to do with his experience of being imprisoned and tortured by his brother. Because his elder brother was jealous of him, he tricked him away before his wedding, imprisoned him, tortured him every day, destroyed his body, and weakened his will. Throw him into the street while he's still breathing. People who used to be very respectful to him, as well as women who came to look for him every day, saw him who looked like a beggar, and they all walked away in disgust. In the eyes of the world, at that moment, he was just a beggar who was about to die, and no one sees that he was young Master Qingxiao. His elder brother trampled him underfoot. You see, you are nothing if you take off your fine clothes and lose your identity as young Master Qingxiao. Jing also knew at that time that he was usually praised and sought after by everyone, but because he had the huge wealth of the Tu Shan family, his status as the son of Qingxiao, and his good looks. When he was lying on the side of the road waiting to die, he ran into Xiao Yao, who didn't dislike his ragged clothes or his dirty body, so she picked him up and went back to his residence for treatment. Carefully scrubbed his body, cleaned his wounds, and combed his dirty hair carefully. Seeing the wounds all over his body, she didn't feel disgusted, but felt a little distressed. Xiao Yao not only saved Tu Shanjing's body, but also his heart. This allowed Tu Shanjing to see Xiao Yao's kindness and compassion for everyone. Therefore, in Tu Shanjing's eyes, no matter what Xiao Yao looks like, she is the most beautiful. Most people in the world are blinded by money and status, and there are very few people who can see the soul through the outside. However, wealth is not yours, skills are not yours, status is not yours, only your heart is yours. Therefore, Tu Shanjing's words seem to be teasing, but they are actually a kind of great wisdom. Not only in love, people should be judged by heart, but in other relationships, why not judge people by heart? This sentence is not so much a love story as it is Jing's epiphany about life after being persecuted by his elder brother.